Go ahead. So, Gaten and yes. Caleb, you yep. guys obviously, season one was released and the phenomena that is Stranger Things came about. Yes. How has the release of season two, two weeks ago, been different? Okay, can I, can I answer this? Than the first season? No. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna answer it anyways. Yeah, right. But, um, first season was like, oh, wow. People really like the show. Yeah, it's crazy. Uh, thank you guys for all the love. Now, season two is just, like, huge. Like, everyone's like, oh, I love the show and stuff. And mom was <laughs> on the stuff. train and stuff. And my mom was on the Amtrak train, uh... The other day, the Amtrak train. I don't know why I said that. But uh, she's like, everyone's watching Stranger Things. And I'm like, wow, people are not coming up to my table. It's like, I hate you now. They're like, I love your character this season. Like, Absolutely. Thank you. And, and with Lucas, how did you create the character? What, what was, you know, at the start um, of the show, how did you, did you watch movies from the 80s? Like, what was the process like for you? Um... I didn't, you know, just to get the whole feel, I had to watch a few uh, 80s, movie, 80s movies, uh, Goonies, E.T. Those are uh, good ones. Yes, Stand By Me. Um, and then I think just being a kid was just the most important part. And the whole bond of, me and Gaten already had a bond, so it was pretty easy. Uh, other than that, I just, I had to create Lucas. I had to get a little bit mean, um, skeptical, you know. Yeah. What about you, Gaten? Yeah. Uh, I watched The Matrix over and over again because just like Dustin, that no one knows what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you I'm know, kidding. Dustin, but, <laughs> Dustin's like the glue of the. Yeah, movie. that's he's, what I like to say. Yeah. You know, I mean, he has that part in like in the first season, episode six, when uh, he when we I make him go to Lucas's house to shake hands and it doesn't work out, but he tried. It's like it's like classroom glue. It's like he like he, good job, man. Good job. But uh, no, I really do like the character that I play, and I really enjoyed preparing for the role. Uh, didn't take much. <laughs> a lot of people say I'm a lot like Dustin. Yeah, especially first season. Especially first season, yeah. Um, yeah, that, that's kind of the reason why, like, they kind of built Dustin, like, around a lot of what yeah. I did. They didn't have a lot for Dustin, and the character's description changed when they cast me for it. Yeah. So. What about you, Sadie? Yeah, no, Sadie, you were actually a fan of the first season, right? Right, yeah. So and you were part of, you know, experiencing what the rest of us experienced, which was, you know, obviously binge watching this incredible show. Um, when you got the chance to audition for Max, what, what was your thought process and, and how did that come about? Right, well, I think I watched the show like two or three days before I got the audition. So that made it like even more exciting that it was Stranger Things, but also even just reading the material, I really connected to the character. And, you know, it didn't matter that it was Stranger Things, I just really liked the material. And do you, I mean, I'm sure everyone asks you this, but I would like to know as well, you look so awesome as a skateboarder in the show. It looks so natural. Have you, did you skateboard before? No, I didn't, I didn't skateboard before, but I had to learn for the show. Well, you did a great job. Thank you. Yeah, 